Thanks for joining us tonight. St. Mary Sheriff's deputies are still searching for an escaped inmate. Jeremy Perez escaped yesterday. He was being held on aggravated flight from an officer and drug charges. Tonight, he's wanted for simple escape. Perez's escape is the second in as many weeks from the parish jail. Just shy of two weeks ago, four inmates escaped from the Centerfield jail. The two of them made it as far as Mississippi before they were caught. All four of these inmates are back in jail tonight. These escapes have St. Mary Parish residents worried about the security at the jail. Our Josh Minnie has our top story. Something's got to be done. I have children. I don't even want to let my kids go outside and play by themselves, you know? That's the general feeling of residents who live near the St. Mary Parish Jail. The recent prisoner escapes have them concerned for their well-being. I think they need to close the prison down until they do some renovations, relocate the prisoners. It's the officers. You know, we need more security around here, man. I stay, I stay around the street, man, and I got kids, man. I don't feel safe around here at all. Residents are also worried that these escapees could encourage other prisoners to try to make a jailbreak or embolden other criminals on the outside. Because someone else could get hurt. The innocent bystander, the innocent person at their home. This convict, whatever they did, escape, might have a gun and knife, don't know, and breaking that person home and harm them. Despite their worries, residents are confident justice will prevail. I don't know if it's an inside job, if it's an outside job. I don't know who's involved and what's going on. And I do know that a person is going to reap what they sow. So you may have gotten away for a few minutes, but you're going to get caught again. In Centerville, Josh Manny, KTC TV3. And here's another look at Jeremy Perez. If you see him, you're urged to call 911. 